guys, and welcome to another episode of Random Aussies. I'm Jamie, your host. Good morning, Crawley on the sound. How are we, buddy? Good morning, little rat bag. How are you? Good morning, Luke on the camera. How are we, mate? Hey, guys. Good to be here again. McLaren Vale, South Australia. Get excited. It's a wine region. It's not all about the wine, though. Give us a little bit more about it, Paulie. Mate, for all those thrill seekers at home that love water sports and stuff, about 10k away, we've got a bay, right? And they do snorkeling, sailing, surfing, swimming. They've got everything you need to do to have a good that holiday. That sounds good, Paul, but yeah. that's not what we're most excited about, let's be honest. What else have they got? The brewery. I'm actually looking forward to trying beer for the very first time. No. And if people believe that, Luke. I'll tell you what they do believe. There's about 4,500 people here. Yep. Get excited, because I'm excited. You guys are excited. We're going to find ourselves a random Aussie now. Yep. And don't forget, Paulie, we might just get a little swim in at lunchtime. Oh, he's mate. a good boss. He's a good boss. He's good. Let's go find someone, guys. We'll check you out there. Come on. Do you reckon we should go get a beer first? That's what I'm saying. We'll go yeah. to the brewery. Paulie, you're the, uh, you're the man in control there in the back. No worries. And keep going up the street, or...? Yeah, why not? No worries, mate. What road are we in now? Oh, we're heading towards there. Yeah. Got it. We're on the right road? Yeah. Just double check, mate. Just double check. I hate reading maps. We're nowhere near it. I can't read maps. <laughs> <laughs> mate, we're over here. We go up here. I'm not very good at road maps either, I mate. can't read. I, I don't know where we are. Mum used to highlight where I go. Oh, and like, you just follow it. Yeah. Do? Most people come to this area and go to the wineries, but not us. Goodison Brewery. Let's go and see what they've got to offer. He's had a big day at the brewery. G'day, pal. What's happening today? Not much. My name's Jamie from a hey. TV show called Random Aussies. OK. We want to have a taste test. We because want to have a taste test. Tell us a little bit about it. So you locally make it here. Yeah, so everything's brewed, bottled, labelled, the works, everything's done here. Oh, geez, I reckon I've earned one of these today. It's weird, Luke never seems to miss out uh, in taste testing when we do have something mm -hmm. alcoholic. <laughs> I've noticed that. Put some olives in front of me, I'm not interested. <laughs> Jamie, I'm really starting to enjoy these. I would have been happy to sit there all day, but we had a show to do, didn't we? You've never done an avocado farm before, what about that? I didn't know they farmed avocados, I thought they just grew on trees. <laughs> Sorry, no avocados. Uh, you see that? What is... Oh no! So sorry, no avocados. Well, don't put a sign out in the road that you've got an avocado farm and there's no avocados. It was a big sign, wasn't it, up there? I mean, some things you do in random Aussie turn out to be crap. Let's go check out the beach. Okay. Welcome to Port Nistelga. Was it? Port Nistelga. No, Port Nistelga. Port Nistelga. Port Nistelga. Nolunga. Well, guys, welcome to Port Nistelga. Nolunga. Nolunga. We wanted to go snorkeling. We didn't have a snorkel. <laughs> There's a young fella in here, he'll know. G'day. G'day buddy, how are you? Do we need one of these? What sizes do we need, yeah. mate? Just one. So we found a snorkel, but uh, in true random Aussie style, <laughs> we didn't have any money. <laughs> how much are they, mate? Uh, they're $39. Are they? Yeah. Do you, do you guys do cheaper for cash? Yeah, do you, you guys do cheaper uh, for no, cash? No, we can't. There's only 39 bucks, like. <laughs> there's a 79. 79. <laughs> oh no, this is interesting. I've got 50 on me, guys. Let me just find it. There's some change in the car. Oh, there is some change in the car. Yeah. I think we, we just got there, but I think we had about 70 cents left over. Yeah. We did, yeah. We were like, I think we saw said, you, you keep it. <laughs> Buy yourself something nice. Mate, things are looking a bit better for us, J-Mo. They are, buddy. Mate, I don't care about any avocados right now. This is good. I'm glad avocados are out of season, to be honest with you. Oh, look, we've got a catch, we've got a catch. We've got a catch, we've got, we got a live catch right here. Right. Let's get in there and have a look. Got a big fish? Good job. Do you want to, what's it called? Red mullet. Oh, red mullet. Oh, give him a kiss, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get him. I'll get him ready, can he? <laughs> give it a kiss, give it a kiss. Get, get in there. Good boy. Go, go. Oh, get in there. Yeah. <laughs> Too small, you got to throw him back, do you? No, this one, there's no start limit. Oh, okay. Yeah. Are they right. nice? Yeah, they're quite nice. Yeah? Yeah. And he caught a fish about the length of my little finger. Mm. He said, oh yeah, that'll make good eating. I wonder how big they really do grow. Bill wasn't giving him the chance to find out. <laughs> uh, this is one thing that I've been taught every time I go snorkeling or diving, and if, if Jamie knew anything about diving, he would tell us to do this. Now, a lot of people freak out with spitting on the inside. Why do you have to spit on the inside, mate? I've never seen it done before. 
were you a little bit worried about the shark factor at this point? You came out and said um, that sharks are attracted to weight. Yeah, so when I was in me. there, I was like flat out, non-stop weighing. Were you? Um, yeah, because you were behind me. <laughs> <It'll just swim laughs> That's why you were saying it's one of the warmest oceans you've ever swum in. <laughs> Nah, it's all right, mate. Nah, you got to jump in, Luke. That was good, man. That was good. Good job. Go on, Luke. will jump in. Jump. Yeah, Luke. You That's did. not going to jump in. <laughs> that wasn't part of the deal. Just watching this footage back now, it doesn't look that high, but when you're actually doing it, oh, oh mate, that, you it's even, not even that high. You didn't even jump up. You I just know, jumped I just down. Fell. <laughs> oh, it's embarrassing. Here you going? And you said only one of your daughters has got a mask. Yeah. We've just used this, right? This is yeah. this is my one, so it's, it's a bit. Spit in it. It's yeah, I spat in it. It's hygienic. <laughs> we'd like to donate that to you, and and and, and, oh. and we'd like your daughter to use that. Thank you. That is awesome. I'll, yeah. I'll sterilise that. And I'll give it. to <laughs> <laughs> McLaren Vale. Hitting the streets, mate. Give some of this. Bang. It's a pretty sleepy sort of town, isn't it? You reckon? Yeah, I suppose it's a wine region. They must drink too much wine. We've got to stop eating junk food when we're away. It's not terrible. <laughs> that's, that's like six days of having a pie for breakfast, and look at it. Look at that. <laughs> look. Look. That's not funny. That's, that's real. That's real-life fatty there. Like, real-life tubs. Look. It goes out. I've never had gut like that. Olives. Look at this. This looks good. Guys, look what I found. Three olives. Herb, garlic, traditional, and chili. Shut your eyes. Yeah. Shut your eyes. I'm going to pick one, see if you can get it. Open your mouth. There we go. Have a go. Chewing it. Oh, Chewing it. And then you've got to work out which one it was. Can Jamie do it? So is it traditional, chili, herb, or garlic? Just tastes like a normal olive, maybe. <laughs> like one. That was a chili. Good okay. work. All right, you do one with me. All right. Here you go. Traditional. Good job. Well done. I thought you got it out of there. I did. <laughs> so it was garlic. <laughs> we have olive oil here in bulk. You got to drink that. The olive oil. Yeah. And drink it. Yeah. And just and swill it, swill it, put it in your mouth. Wow. And rub it on your lips. It's really fruity. A little bit mm. of spice. Yeah. It's full of a sap. That was shocking. That f***ing oil made me feel sick. Like the olive. Ooh, oil. It's just stuck on <laughs> guts. <laughs> I can't believe you drank the oil. You don't you drink oil like that. You don't drink oil. <laughs> oh. Where are you now? So what's going on, mate? What's going on? Uh, we've just got to go and uh, find someone. It's getting a little bit late in the day now. The problem is, too, is that it looks like a lovely little quaint town. There's some beautiful shops around, but there's no walking traffic. It's spread out and everyone seems to drive to where they're going. Hey, buddy. How you going, mate? Yeah, mate. Good, thanks. Yeah, he didn't want to stop. What we could hang, to, hang for a couple of hours after you knock off. What time do you knock off? What? You come on, I'm going to go I just said the banking. We haven't going to take any money off you. <laughs> you can. Have a bit of a chat. Get nah, a bit of insight into your life I or not? I would be able to now. That's the only thing. Oh, uh, okay. This is what um, affects the show. When we are tired and we are a yeah. bit run down, it's, there's no energy today. Mm. And what's your last name? Uh, I'm not getting involved in this. That's great. Have a good day. Oh, I've just got that oil in my stomach. Oh, how much oil did you feed me? <laughs> Sick of walking. And we couldn't find a random Aussie. Things are looking pretty grim at this stage, aren't they? <laughs> that's not acting. That's just you two just being stuck. It's weird because we're almost we're did it. begging for... Oh, we couldn't have gone any harder. <laughs> I reckon yeah. Pam needs to be the random Aussie, do you? No, Pam doesn't do I think she'd be a great random Aussie. She's no, a little character. too much commitment elsewhere. <laughs> no. We're still trying to get a random Aussie yeah, and, so, and suss that. out the shit, you know? That's why I've got to ask questions to say yeah, what you're doing, what you're doing, what you're doing, and just yeah. move on. Because I, I can't just keep playing games in there. What's happening? Uh, Patrick, there you go. Patrick? I didn't oh. get home. Hey? I'm, driving. I'm driving. Okay. We're in despair. We're thinking it's getting too late, guys. Hey. Okay. Hello. How you going? You finished work? Yes. Hi, I'm Jamie. Off to the physio. Off to the physio. What have you done to yourself? Uh, got a 
got a bad ankle. What are you guys oh, no. doing? We're doing a TV random show. Aussies. Yeah, we're doing a TV show called Random Aussies. Are oh. you a local girl here? Yeah, I work across the road. And how long you worked at Better Electrical for? Um, my whole life. It's actually my parents' shop. Oh, no. good on you. Family business. <laughs> Love it. Has have you found your random Aussie yet? No, we're thinking you might be all right. <laughs> how long are you in there getting your uh, work done on your done? foot? Probably about an hour. Okay. I'm going in there because my ankle, yeah. I, ju we, I just got married on the coast, obviously down yeah. here, like five weeks ago. Second day of honeymoon, we went to Bali and I had a scooter accident. And that's what... Oh no. Am I allowed to swear? No, obviously. Uh, yeah, you can swear if you want. That's why I my ankle. <laughs> <laughs> and what's the hubby think of that? Uh, he went and got me chocolate when I needed it. Oh, really? <laughs> and what's he do for a living? He works at Prominent Hill, wins in the mines. Oh, okay. And where's that from here? That is just near Cooper Pedy. Oh wow, so, so he travels and away and fly out. out? Yeah. Okay, is he home at the moment or away? Or? He's home at the moment, oh, yeah. Oh cool, so Goes we can we have a chat to him as well maybe. Yeah, <laughs> we have got people coming over for dinner, but I mean oh. they won't care. What? <laughs> well, she's been in an accident in Bali or something and she's just going to get a bit of physio on her foot. The good thing we, we knew she... was if, if we approached her, she's not going to uh, run away. Gonna, she's not going to get could, far. She tried, she hobbled. She couldn't make it fast enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love it. Well, we'll, well, we should catch up with you after that, do you reckon? No worries. Will that be all right? How long are you going to take in there? About an hour, you said? About an hour. Sweet, darling. Are you happy we'll to be the random Aussie? No. I'll be the random Aussie. <laughs> now we're going to go and talk to your mum. Go on, Julia. Julia? Yep. Say that. She's got a good story too. You'll all love right. it. We'll go say hello to Julia. <laughs> and Panda. And Panda's Pan the dog. Oh, Panda. <laughs> we'll get the goss. See you in an hour. Okay, See excellent. Thanks, Crystal. Bye bye. Finally, there you mate. Go. We found one. Mate, oh, Crystal. Gosh. We just wrapped. What are the chances? She works here at the old. Uh, she does. Better Electrical. Yep. And she was walking across to the physio and we ran into her. Okay, guys, now I want you to look up at that Better Electrical uh, sign there. You'll see it reads 29 degrees, 458. Now, we come past early in the day, it was at least 12, 12.30, and it was still reading 29 degrees. That's a long time we've been doing this. G'day, panda. It looks like a panda. Hello. Sit. Hello, Sit. panda. Sit. Hello, Julia. Hi, Hi. I'm Jamie. Pleased to meet you. Hi, Jamie. This is Paul and this is Luke. Hi, Paul. How are you? This is Panda. This is Panda. This is your daughter's dog. This is my granddaughter. Granddaughter. We've got a grand dog. <laughs> Crystal has actually agreed to be our random Aussie for the day, so we're going to be able to hang around with her for a couple of hours and find out a little bit about her. Okay. But we thought we'd come to you first, didn't we, Jamie? We did. She's over at the physio. Right, we know that. We ran into her there. Uh, well, Crystal's a very random Aussie. She's, she's, she's great. one in a million. Fantastic. <laughs> and how was the wedding? And the wedding was fantastic. It was um, it was just incredible. The day was perfect. Oh, and you cried? But, no, 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 no. Just the odd tear. Oh. It was just so beautiful. Does she have any hidden talents that we might not know about yet? Um, other than extreme kindness. Oh, we love that in person. Yeah, Crystal is super disciplined and hardcore trainer because we go to boot camp together. Oh. And she's devastated that she can't come at the moment because cool. of her ankles. So, so she's right into her training and fitness and yeah, that sort of thing, super okay? Fit, super healthy. <laughs> Much like ourselves, Paul. Yeah. Here she comes, guys. Hello, Crystal, how are you? Yeah, no, I was kind of kind of hoping you guys would be gone. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon we need to find a little bit about you, Crystal. Sure. Wanna? Yeah, absolutely. Can we go have a look in the shop? Yep, come Tell on us over. Just a bit about yourself and that. No yeah. worries. Boys, I've always wanted to go into Better Electrical after hours. Well, this is what they call help yourself time. Yes. Uh, you're a sales yes. manager. Yep. Sales Fantastic. Manager. So you work on the floor. You have a lot of local customers that would shop here. Yep. Lot What's of your local favourite ones? thing to do here? Favourite thing to do is sell, probably. Good on you. talking to the people. Yeah. So sales techniques, I want you to try one on Jamie. <laughs> okay. Uh, he's interested in buying a, uh, a dryer. A dryer? Oh, no, what, uh, what about a washing machine? Uh, yeah, a washing machine. <laughs> That's great. Now, I can guarantee you that he's never used one before. So <laughs> well, this is really easy to use. Is it? Yeah. For a man? Just press start. Oh. <laughs> It's sold. It's sold. <laughs> What's your husband's name again? His name's Sienna, but everyone calls him Wooly. Oh, Wooly. That's easy. Wooly. Wooly's a lot easier. Uh, is that because of his hair? Yes. Really? So yeah. he's got a heap of hair? He's got a heap of hair. Would he be interested in <laughs> transplanting some hair onto my hair? <laughs> and I hear he's a good cook. He is. And we haven't been back to too many random Aussies houses and had never. dinner. No, no never. This will be a first. first. What do you reckon, guys? Should we go? Yeah. We should go. Let's go yeah. meet him. Let's go meet him. Okay, come on, guys. Let's do it. Thank you. <laughs> 
was pretty cool. We haven't been invited back to a random Aussie's house before for dinner. Never. First time for everything on random Aussie's. Crystal. Hi, guys. Thank you Hi. for having us. Come on in. Thank you. G'day, guys. Hey. 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 I can call you Willie. That's it, mate. How Cheers, mate. I'm Jamie. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. We've met your lovely wife today. What a great person. She's not bad. And, uh, <laughs> and you're a bit of a worker. You work away as well a bit. Yep. Yep. Up in the mines, I hear. So yeah. you get to use like explosives and no, stuff? No, no, no. I just get... I don't... He gets to get out of the way when that happens. <laughs> that's what everyone thinks. No, I just, I just um, operate the drill rigs to drill the holes. Yeah, cool. So, Could you use dynamite if you wanted to? Like, can, oh. can we... No. <laughs> and you got some mates here, I think, out the front. Is that all right? And they invited some friends around. Instead of saying, look, mate, we've got friends coming around for dinner, they said, oh, you don't mind our friends being there? No. Nah. And they were, they were awesome. Yeah, yep. Scott and Emily. Where'd you actually get married? Just down here, uh, on the beach. beach. On the beach. beach. Yeah. And, and we heard that there was dolphins come up just as you passed the microphone. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Crazy. What do you call this little meal here? Chicken. <laughs> so we've been we've been actually mucking around with you guys. This is all, it's all been bullshit. We're actually my kitchen rules, and we're. What do you think, Manu? The flavor is beautiful, but I prefer the wine than the food. How often would he do this when he's uh, when he's back? Every night that he's home. Oh, oh how do you nah. let him leave after that? Like, it's well hard. Trained, it's really hard. You know, they put on the whole spread for us. You know. And yeah. a bottle of wine. Yeah, which we, you know, we, we, we didn't say no to, did we? <laughs> Thank you so much for having us for tea. Our this pleasure. Is a, this is an honour for us, yeah. seriously. No worries. Um, to meet new people and just have a ball and get to know a bit about each other. Yeah. How good was it, like, what, like eight hours ago we didn't know each other and now we're pretending that we like each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's great. We heard a lot about Woolies cooking today. What do you think, Jamie? Well, that's very good. Extremely good. Oh. Jamie, that's a before and after shot. You don't look like you were too disappointed there. Oh, I'll tell you, we needed there. some sustenance, didn't we? We needed sustenance. Mate, that was unbelievable. Dinner. Woolies. Beautiful. Thank you so much, guys. Our pleasure. Well, look, we're around the round table. We've never done this before. <laughs> Where did you guys meet? At, at high school. High school? Yeah. Tell us the story. What happened when you guys sort of looked across the math room and... <laughs> <laughs> We were, we, were good, we were just good friends for years and then... Go, how did you um, bring it up? Like it's a hard thing when you're friends to say, mm. you know, let's take it to the next level. What did it you do? Happened. <laughs> yeah. I think we just started making out. Yeah. <laughs> how did you propose, mate? Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, what did you do? It was in... New Zealand. Like I proposed and then I... He didn't yeah. sort of know, he couldn't, he didn't know if he wanted to get on one knee or not, so he yeah. was kind of bobbing. So I was like, <laughs> yeah. I'll show you how I did it. Show us how you did it. I'm playing your darling wife now. We look very similar, I understand that, but... Um... We've gone back to the gardens and like... I was turned, I was turned around, turned around to start like, yeah. taking photos. And then I turned around, he was in his bag. And I was scuffing him a bag, yeah. so I turned around now. Yeah. And then I just pulled this thing out and I just opened it up. Yeah. And she just like stares at it. And I'm just like, oh, will you marry me? And then I'm just like, oh, shit. Knock down, then I'll come back up. And I'll come down. I will, I will, I will. <laughs> so you went to school locally here. You've grown up here. What are your hobbies? Fitness. Good. You're pretty heavily into that, aren't you? Both of you. Yeah, Woolies. Yeah. We've heard that Woolies got a six pack, but we'll look at that later. Yeah. Can we can we just see a little bit of the flex again? Because that was <laughs> just over <laughs> over. Good for it'll, this'll this actually boost us. Yeah, it'll boost I'll get a freeze one anymore. I used to have one, but I don't have got it anymore. What about you? Oh. Just a little flex of the bicep. Come on, that's all we asked for. Look at that. Oh. Oh. There it is. Can you can you make your boobs move? There it is. Oh, there oh. Now, Crystal, I'm going to ask a question. Yes. What has been the toughest period of your life? Mm. The toughest period of my life? Remember the time you had chronic fatigue syndrome? Now, you got through that really well. I didn't have chronic fatigue. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I, um, I had a lot of back issues in, at the end of high school. Okay. And that was, that was pretty tough because yeah. I just wanted to be like normal, yeah, same yeah. as everyone yeah. else. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I could, there was things I couldn't do and that frustrated me because I don't like to admit I can't do anything. Mm -hmm. So it's fixed? Did you have an operation? Yeah, or yeah, I had corrective surgery in year eight. Yep. Yeah, and then again in year nine because the first one didn't work. Mm -hmm. You work away in the mines, will you? Yeah. 
that must be really tough on you guys working apart. Um, how does that go? Um, oh, I've been doing it for a few years now, so I think we, well. we were really good at it. We got really good at it. But he's just gone from one and one, like one week yeah. on, one week off, they to two and awesome. one. Oh, so they've just changed the two roster. Two and one off. Yeah. 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 Okay. Which so is just, a bit harder. Yeah. It's not bad. A lot of places, that's what normal rosters are. But yeah, we are just blessed with the week on, week off with roster. the original one. So and then he was the... home for the wedding and we were together for like five weeks and then, oh. mm. and then he's gone again. So mm. it's just getting back into that routine. Yeah, it can tear a lot of relationships apart, but... I think if it ever started getting too much, then it wouldn't be worth it, but... Exactly. For now, sure. it works. Yeah. What can we find out about Crystal that no one else knows? Do you know what I mean? Like, no one. Oh, oh you know I always think about that. I always, that's like one question, I, if I could ask everyone. Yeah. I'd be ask like, us. tell me what... Okay, tell me something that no one else knows about you. No one, and I mean even like your missus. <laughs> so like, pe do people know everything about you? Or is there one I, thing that you keep when, hidden, you know? When I was younger, I haven't told anyone this and I did it on my own. This guy, his name was <laughs> and he lived down the street and he was a computer geek, didn't like him much. Anyway, he tried to pick up my girlfriend who was over from France. Her name was Marie. So I went to his house of an evening and just put gloves on, balaclava, got some sugar, right? Read on the internet that if you put sugar in a motor that it stuffs it up. So I crept up, opened it, put sugar all the way into his thing, closed it, and I've never like told anyone and his car was off the road in about three days. Oh. And I haven't told anyone. <laughs> no, we won't use that. Now, I like, didn't mean it like a confession. It's not no, a confession. No, <laughs> it, I've had a couple, f it. Let's do it, guys. I want to be part of the crew now. Oh. <laughs> well, you are part of the crew, we're all here. And as part of our show, Crystal, I mean, it's been a great afternoon. Thank you for having us in the house, guys. Nice. Woolie's nice. been a champion. Woolly. Thanks for being here tonight, guys. Really appreciate it. But what we do on Random Aussies every week for our Random Aussie, we give you a t-shirt. We give. We give. We, we give. give. We do. We do That's give. Right. You Thank you very much. Now there's your very own Random Aussie t-shirt. Yeah, look at that. And uh, <laughs> thank you so much for being part of the show. No, thank you guys. No we worries. really loved it. We loved the dinner. You are the best Random Aussie ever. <laughs>